Here the question is: Postal rates for light letters are 25p up to 10g, 35p up to 50g, plus an extra 10p for each additional 25g up to 100g. Which test inputs in grams would be selected using equivalence partitioning? And these are our options. Let's draw the equivalence partitioning diagram. As per the question, postal rates for light letters are 25 page up to 10 gram. So here, 10 gram is at the boundary. Next condition is 35 pages up to 50 gram. The next boundary is at 50 gram. Now the next condition is very important. An extra 10 pages for each additional 25 grams up to 100 gram. Here, for the next condition, we have to look into previous condition. Here we have 35 pages. Do we have to add 10 more pages? With that, we will get 45 pages. And in the 50 gram, we have to add 25 gram. With this, we will get next boundary, which is 75 gram. But the condition will not end here, as we have not yet reached 100 grams. So we have to repeat the process again. In 45 pages, we have to add 10 pages. With this, we will get 55 pages. And in 75 gram, we have to add 25 gram. With this, we will get next boundary, which is 100 gram. With this, the last condition is fulfilled as we reached 100 gram. Now the equivalence partitioning diagram is complete. Now let's analyze the options one by one. Option A is 8, 42, 82, 102. 82. Option B is 4, 15, 65, 92. One hundred fifty-nine. Option C is ten, fifty, seventy-five, one hundred. Option D is five, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty. As per the question, we have to find which test inputs in grams would be selected using equivalence partitioning. You may get confused between option B and C, but here, option B is the correct answer because it covers all the equivalence classes. Option B is the answer.